Hi, I wanted to take a quick opportunity and literally I am going to speed through this because um, I appreciate everybody is busy. But one of the things that's come up uh, with the online courses is it's kind of a new thing. I'm doing them because it can make what I do accessible to lots of different people in lots of different places in the world. You know, best intentions, not everybody can fly from Australia to come on, on a workshop or a day's clinic. And so how do we reach out to those horses, donkeys and mules around the world and let people actually experience some of what I'm trying to do to help them grow, to learn um, and those sorts of things. So the online experience is something which I think has tremendous ability to help owners and their animals uh, wherever they are in the world. And I just wanted to walk you through some of the elements of it so that you can just get a sense of it, you can understand it, you can decide if it's for you, it becomes familiar for you. Let's take out that fear of, of the online learning. It works really well in fitting into people's lives. You know, taking a whole weekend to come on a workshop's one thing and, and that you know kind of good you force yourself into that situation and the travel and the accommodation and all those sorts of things but actually what I think is working really well is to take a topic, break it down small into little videos as you'll see and play it so that you can do it at your own pace. Uh, you do a little bit, you do a bit of learning, you work with your horse, you digest those pieces of learning. Actually, I think we get a much better learning experience, but you fit it into your life. You can you can take a break for a week, you can take a break for a month if you need to. You can do it a, a little bit at a time, you can sit down and do the whole thing in one go. It's, it's entirely up to you, and that flexibility, I think, is really important in learning. And so I'm just going to take you through some of these steps that uh, are involved in um, the learning process and you'll see uh, just a few slides to give you some screenshots so that you can see how do I find an online course? Well, it's simply just go Ben Hart, Thinkific on your um, browser search engine. It's going to come up. You can see the platform there and pretty quickly underneath it you've got some of the individual courses or, or my whole uh, platform. And when you click on that link, it's going to take you here, you're going to see some of the courses that are available with a brief description and, and if they've got a, uh, a review from people you see the stars there so it gives you a little bit of an indication. Um, do remember to go down to the bottom of the page and I've just put that green arrow there to show you this is a page two as well so click across because there's some bundles and some new online coaching uh, that I've put in place there and you can see those different things along with the free ebooks that you can you can download and uh, use now um, what you're seeing here is the different uh, courses and this is the page two for you so that's the really easy way to find this if you want and prefer then you can simply go to uh, heartsourcemanship.com uh, and there you'll see uh, on the page this area just here which is the thoughts page and what I wanted to say the thoughts page for me is a really unused resource there are just a huge number of uh, articles and ideas and thought processes and access to uh, my YouTube stuff and, and various things like that so you see all sorts of um, really great stuff in there so if you're not using that thoughts page maybe have a look through it see what articles in there see what content that really might be able to help you it's all free it's all there for you to, to play with um, but we're going back to that main page again and we're looking just here under thoughts you've got courses and online learning uh, there's one of the other courses there, the Total Confidence course, but just click on that and that's going to take you through to a page that I have, uh, oh, hang on, I've lost the page for you there, sorry. Um, that should then take you through to a page that has all the different descriptions on um, and from there you can click on to this particular uh, page and you choose one of those descriptions and, and you go and you look at the Put In Your Horse First description. You can scroll down on that page and right at the bottom, there's a take a look now. A couple of widgets there, click on those and it will take you straight to that Think Ific page that you've seen. If you're a Facebook fan, then just uh, go to the shop in Facebook on my Facebook page, have a little look at that. You can see again here, I've just marked this in green for you. Really simple, choose the course that you want. There's some ebooks and stuff there as well, but uh, choose a course, click on it. Up comes this uh, lovely little additional piece there. Putting your horse first, uh, it's not difficult check out uh, uh, on the website you don't actually have to check out at that stage it just takes you through uh, back to the website and what it will do is take you straight to that particular course so 
in any of those three ways, you're going to end up at something like this when you click on a course. Um, what you're going to see basically um, is on that course description, the details of, of the course, why it's there. Now, mine's a little bit different here because obviously it's asking me to resume the course because I'm already enrolled in it, you'll be glad to know. Um, but for you, it'll just have this element here where you will see these different pieces. Watch the intro video, and I'll go through each of those for you in a minute. But we've got the content, you'll scroll down, it tells you uh, some social proof there from people who have taken the course or other courses that I've run. Um, a little bit about me, if you're not familiar, and the further you scroll down, you've got that course curriculum. Um, and there's quite a bit on this one. Uh, this is the Trust Confidence course and you'll see how to shape behavior. So there's three chapters as they're put there and each chapter has uh, these different elements within it. And you'll see marked with this little green bit here is a free element of the course. So that means you essentially you can click on that um, and you'll see here it says free trial. That will take you through and you can look at the, the three elements I'll show you in a moment or two. If you're thinking, is this course for me, you can watch the intro video. Just pops up there right in front of you, don't have to go anywhere. It will play automatically. Have a listen to that. Close the window when you want to and you're back at that screen again. Um, if you want to go through to that free content, what you'll do is you'll click on it and it'll take you through here. You'll see these little uh, green bits that you can click on and you can watch those free elements. You can download a workbook or whatever I've, I've put in there as a free element to see if the course is, is for you and you want to enjoy that and you want to learn from that bit. Hopefully it's there to give you a feeling for the course. It's there to give you an opportunity to explore if it's the right course for you. There are other elements there that are, aren't marked as free. Uh, if you click on those, it'll just say those aren't available for you yet, but you can purchase now by clicking here, and, and, it, and it clicks through. So, if you go through the Buy Now button, if you go through that um, element of the free piece that I'm showing you there, what you end up with is your purchase uh, area. Um, and you can pay by PayPal, uh, or you can pay with a credit or debit card. That's entirely up to you. I don't get to see any of those details. They're kept uh, completely safe. This is all um, completely... Um, protected so that your details I never see them uh, and it goes uh, off into um, the protection that you would expect from any online payment. What then happens is that course comes up on your dashboard and uh, what you'll see is you'll get a page and again here I've got these courses which I'm all enrolled in and it'll tell you how much you've done of the course um, which is a little reminder there it says you can resume the course and you've got some other elements along the top which I will share with you in a moment. Um, it really is up to you whether you do the courses all together or you do one at a time, whether you have your online um, ebook there and you've downloaded that. It's totally flexible in, in what suits you and how it really works. That's the exciting bit about the online learning. And um, you, you click on your course, resume course, it comes through to show you here on this lovely uh, landing page that you come for the students. You've got the video, anything with this little triangle, pretty obvious, is a video, you can play that. Down the side is all of the content. I have tried to lay it out so it's in some sort of structured order, so you probably just want to work down that through, through that. There are video files, there are PDF files, there are downloadable things, there are text and there's some downloadable sort of picture quotes and stuff like that you might want to think about. On every course uh, there's also uh, workbooks and I'll show you one of those in a moment. But basically there is uh, your video, you press play, up I come, uh, talking away to you and you're able to listen to that video, stop, reverse, everything you'd expect to do with a normal video, pretty simple. If you want to go to this little brown area up here, gives you a few ideas. You can uh, open a discussion. So if you click discussion, you can ask a question. It will automatically send me a message to tell me someone's asked a question, and I can answer that question for you there. It also does this thing where it tells you how much you've achieved and, and what progress you've still got to make as a little reminder. So that's a, a good way. And, and do you know, ask questions or check. And, and they're open for other people to answer as well if they want to. You'll see here there's a workbook, 
So what I've done for the courses is to allow you, funnily enough, to work through them, is to create some workbooks that you can tick stuff off, that have got exercises on, that have got spaces for you to write notes on the videos or on, on the things that I'm suggesting you can do. Uh, generally what I've done is create those in two ways. You can take them out as a PDF file, so you've got this kind of book here that you're looking at, um, and you can read and, and just print that off and write it in hand. Or if you prefer, you can download it as a Word document so that you can type in the answers. Um, so you, if you're more inclined to do typing and, and have that sort of physical like that, you can do that. If you want to just download and print it off and write, you can do that too. So we've got all of those options as you work through uh, the course. And there are other things such as this total confidence problem solving measuring recording so you download that and you can measure where you think you are in your confidence. So everything's really easy to access, to print off, to download uh, as you go through. Um, at each chapter you can click on it, open it up, make various elements. Here again you can see this one, this is two vital elements for success, so you play the video and it gives you all those key uh, sessions which is really cool. Um, and, and you just go through that learning process. Do a minute, do five minutes, do 15 minutes an evening, whatever you want to do as you go through. Your student dashboard, I just wanted to draw a little bit of attention here to you. So it's there for you. Um, this is your courses, all the courses you can go back and look at the other courses. You've obviously got uh, your dashboard, so this is the example of that, tells you where you are on the courses and what you've already done, so you can manage that. Um, about Ben, that's a little bit about me. If, you, if you're not familiar with it, you can go and have a little read about who I am and what I do. Um, you've got the Facebook page. If you're a Facebook fan, you want to link through there. If you're not already following and you want to, great. If you just want to return to Facebook and have a look. The website, again, for that thoughts page, so you can go and find more stuff there. Admin, so if you get stuck, you've got support issues, you can contact through there. And this little bit here, which says Ben H, which will actually have your initials in there, uh, will lead you through to your profile. So you can fill in details. Let me just get rid of my picture there for you for a moment. You can fill in your profile picture if you want to, to do that, your details, what you do for your company, where you are in the world. That really helps me to know about timings of things. Um, and your password if you want to change it, notifications. So think of it tends to send out a weekly, this is how much you've done email. If you don't want that, just go there, click it off, uh, and that's gone for you. Uh, your billing details and any uh, order history that you've made. So all your details are there. Uh, I really don't think it could be any simpler than, than that. Uh, I hope you agree that you know, it's pretty straightforward. A few clicks and you're learning, it's under your control, it's where you go. I just want to say uh, one final thing really is if you are watching that this weekend, so this is the 1st of December to midnight on the 3rd of December, little Christmas offer, 12% off all the individual courses. Just enter uh, uh, deck 17 uh, at the checkout. So go, go through that process, click, when you get to the checkout, put in uh, on the order code the uh, deck 17 code that will automatically take 12% off for you as a little Christmas present um, but it also I think this is a gift that keeps on giving you know weeks months of work allowing you to be able to observe learn grow challenge have a look at some of the reviews what people have said about courses um, if you've got questions email me message me get in touch to say um, I want to know this, I want to know that, um, is this right for me and I can try and help out in those situations. I hope this has given you a, a sense of, of what's involved, how easy it is to do and the reason I think online learning gives us a great opportunity to continue to move forward with our equines even when we don't necessarily have a huge amount of money, we don't have a huge amount of time but we are desperate to be the best humans we can be for our equines. Thank you very much in, for your time. Um, seasons greetings and um yeah use that offer if you get a chance this weekend would be a really smart thing to do i guess save some money why not thanks very much indeed and good luck